We are a nation at war with invisible forces. Itu kerajaan memutuskan untuk melaksanakan perintah kawalan pergerakan. Firstly, ODL, Open and Distance Learning. This method has been created by the government since the pandemic of COVID-19. So, this is the video. Hello, welcome back. So, through this ODL and this pandemic session, I have learned a lot from UED or study skills, such as getting ready to learn for week one, we cover over two topics, which is getting ready to learn and goal setting. For week two, we have covered two topics also, time management and getting to know the campus. And for week three, we only cover one topic, which is memory learning and improving concentration. And for week four, we cover two topics, which is taking lectures known and academic integrity and performance. And my experience on this ODL is, is about not good and not bad because I prefer face to face but I understand that we need to keep our distance for the sake of our own life for the sake of our country and yeah I learned a lot during this UED session and I think it is very helpful for my daily life and I can implement it in my daily life and my university life uh, because to be honest UED is very helpful subject for me uh, I can relax myself I know how to memorize I, I know the best strategy for uh, studies I know how to manage my time I can make my own schedule uh, for example a to-do schedule or my study schedule yeah, it's a very positive uh, vibes from this subject and I really love this subject actually. It's one of my favorite subjects because uh, it's about our daily life and it is very, very, very helpful for those students that are having a problem during this ODL. Make sure you guys focus on this class and if they, even if they give you a recorded video, just watch it. Believe me, it is worth it. So, uh, behind of this positivity, there's a lot of obstacles that coming through my way. And I'm going to tell you about my obstacles and my way to overcome the obstacles. My first obstacle is, I'm a lazy person. And I have a way to overcome my laziness, which is by stay motivated, always motivate myself by telling me that this is for my future i need to study for my future and only education can change my life and my second obstacle is uh, is my study environment because i'm not at campus i'm at my house which is uh which is not suitable for study and i need to change my whole room my setup to study and yeah my way to overcome is just decorate it a bit buy a new table for study uh, and always focus and my third obstacles which is uh, the biggest obstacles I've gone through is I can't stay focused for a very long time because our class is ODL so we can close our camera, close our mic and give a stupid reason uh, like we don't have line or we don't have uh, a very good connection which is a lie and my way to overcome is uh, also motivate myself 
and I ask a motivation for from my family, from my from my peers, from my friends, so that I could stay motivated and always try forward and never look back. Thank you, and that's it. Uh, that is my experience on ODL, my obstacles, uh, my way to prevent it, my way to overcome it, and don't forget to like, and don't forget to comment if you got anything to ask, and yeah, for my fellow peers out there, this is the Malaysi. Remember one thing: only education can change your future. Remember that. Don't be lazy like me. But that is the only me. Not lazy. Bye bye.